folks here we are another fucking review um gonna try and make this one fucking pretty short and fucking sweet I'm fucking super hot the weather is fucking it's just killing me over here man anyway um today we're gonna talk about this absolute fucking Fucking animal of a fucking release. Cavern rehearsal. <whistles> My dudes, trust me when I say I wouldn't put you wrong. This fucking this beast. It's just gonna it's just it's just gonna kill you, man. If you like your fucking death metal fucking kinda doom soaked fucking just gnarly in so many fucking ways, my dudes. You know. Let's get let's get the basics out of the way. You're gonna get gnarly ass cover art like this. You're getting dudes that are fucking obviously, obviously from the USA, Bellingham, Washington. I have no clue where that is. I'm in fucking Ireland. Four man band. Uh, you're getting NE on bass, DF on guitar, SW on guitar, and KM handling the drums and vocals. I picked up my copy from Blood Harvest Records. I don't know what more I can say about this dude. It's a fucking three track. I refrain from saying a demo, rehearsal, you say, whatever it is. So it's going to play the same both sides. Um, the actual fucking tape. You're going to have these fucking gnarly fucking skulls. They run the same. Uh, both sides. I mean, the all tracks are untitled, by the way. So when you first throw on the cassette or whatever way you're going to be listening to it in the future or whatever you're going to be met with a fucking crushing guitar riff just guitars at bass in there as well then you're going to fucking get met with the onslaught introduced to the fucking goddamn bowl crushing drums and vocals come in It's going to blast the best memories that you ever had in your life out of your head with the crushing, raw, fucking beauty. The spectral voice influence and a la all those types of bands that we've seen in the last couple of years are all over this, but they still have their own touch on the, the doom, fucking death metal, fucking, you know, type fucking shit we've got going and then uh, just when you think you've been brought, brought to the depths of fucking bowl crushing vocals it'll change it up man and uh, sometimes you're gonna get fucking like these fucking faster pre fa faster paced tremolo riffs and uh, you're gonna have the higher fucking kind of wailing shrieks of fucking black metal man and it's gonna make, uh, for me anyway, it puts shivers down my fucking, my spine dude, it made me just go, oh fuck, this is something, this is something different, you know what I mean, it was like, oh fuck, I cannot wait to hear more from these dudes, and that is the absolute truth, I really cannot, I really fucking cannot, Um, I have this different fucking cover, uh, from some other shit I've seen, but, 
I don't know. I know there's other fucking things out of it, obviously. But, uh, yeah, it hits every fucking sweet spot that I have in fucking what I look for in my fucking death metal. I mean, I'm not a massive Doom fan, but I do love fucking um, death metal with fucking massive Doom influence, if you know what I mean. But uh, I'm not a huge Doom in the genre fan. Uh, what more can I say? Do I have some notes? Let me see if I have some notes. I think I've already said that. I bought, I got mine from Blood Harvest Records. Uh, oh yeah, getting back to the vocals. Uh, the, the deeper guttural vocals are gonna come in fucking <laughs> guttural, obviously, but they have this fucking echoing cavernous feel, which I thought was pretty f fitting to the name, cavern. I sound so cheesy fucking saying that, but it's, it is true, like, everything about the album is cavernous. It's almost, I feel like it's, it's super hard to find a, a death metal album that brings that kind of feel and energy to the forefront of their sound, which I'm super pumped about. Can I, I think I said that already, I'm super pumped to hear more from these dudes. Yeah, the negative space, and when I say the negative space in tracks, I mean when it just kind of fucking zones out with fucking some uh, guitar distortion ringing out or whatever, and then everything comes back in and just crushes your skull completely. It just, it just fucking kills it, dudes. It just kills it. I cannot recommend this goddamn fucking release enough get it, support the bands, I'm not going to ramble on for too long, um, get it dudes, support it, it is fucking early, and my dudes need more recognition, recognition, even though they're already fucking kind of getting there, but, that'll do it for this one dudes, uh, appreciate you if you fucking watch till the end or whatever. Catch you in the next fucking cartoon.